Hello, dear friends. Welcome back. Welcome back to our lesson for you, dear friends. As we are discussing about the organs or in the each quadrant of our abdominal cavity. So up to now, I have discussed about the organs which are present in the right upper quadrant. Then we discussed in uh, about the organs which are present in the right lower quadrant. Now let us focus on the organs which are present in the left upper quadrant of our abdominal cavity right friends so let's go further forward the links of all these videos are given in the description of this video you can watch those lectures also so this is our left upper quadrant right so let me write it here left upper quadrant which structures are present, which organs are found in the left upper quadrant of our abdominal cavity. Let's see it. The first class of organs that will be present here are the digestive organs. Which digestive organs are present in the left upper quadrant of our abdominal cavity? So let's see which structures we can find here look carefully friends the first and the most important thing that you see here is the lift loop of the liver right as you can see here we have drawn the liver the right loop of the liver most parts of it is present in the right upper quadrant but the lift loop of the liver moves towards the lift upper quadrant of your abdominal cavity so you first of all we say that the lift loop lift loop of liver is found in the left upper quadrant of the abdominal cavity as you can see i have drawn it a very little part and the lift loop of the liver i have drawn here right then the next thing that is present in the left upper quadrant of the abdominal cavity which plays its role in the digestion of food is your stomach you should not forget your stomach so most parts of the stomach is found there in the left upper quadrant but the in the right upper quadrant only the pyloric part of the stomach that i have mentioned here the pylorus of the stomach is present in the right upper quadrant right so most parts of our stomach is present in the left upper quadrant of our abdominal cavity right the next next thing that plays its role in the digestion of food which is found in the left upper quadrant of your abdominal cavity is the is your pancreas right look if you look at the pancreas this is the neck of the pancreas then the body of the pancreas and then the tail of the pancreas but the head of the pancreas is shown here in the right upper quadrant as i have discussed in the previous lecture right so the head of the pancreas is present in the right upper quadrant and the tail body and the neck of the pancreas is found in the left upper quadrant and pancreas is also a digestive organ right so we say pancreas which parts of the pancreas neck body and tail of tail of pancreas is found in the left upper quadrant of your abdominal cavity so this is the third digestive organ which is present there the fourth one that we should not forget look carefully the first part of your jejunum right we say first part of jejunum is there right the fifth organ which is found there is the uh, the proximal parts of the ileum is found there right proximal part of ileum is there look the black shows the jejunum and the blue shows the the green shows the ileum right friends the sixth important thing that is present the organ that is present in the left upper quadrant of your abdominal cavity which plays its role in the digestion is uh, the left part of uh, the transverse colon right so left half not part left half of transverse 
colon right as i have told you the right half of the transverse colon is present in the right upper quadrant you can see here but the left half of transverse colon is present in the left upper quadrant right then the seventh part is the colic flexure right so here was the uh, hepatic flexure here is the splenic flexure as this flexure is pointing towards the spleen right so this is the splenic flexure so we see the splenic flexure there in the left upper quadrant the splenic flexure is there and the last thing that plays its role in the digestion but present in the left upper quadrant is the proximal part of descending colon look other parts are going towards the lower quadrant left lower quadrant but the first part of the descending colon is present in the left upper quadrant so we say here proximal part of proximal descending colon descending colon is present there in the left upper quadrant of your abdominal cavity right friends then the next group of organs that you say that uh, that are, that are found in the left upper quadrant these are the endocrine organs right are there any endocrine organs in the left upper quadrant of your abdominal cavity left up endocrine organs yes we have certain endocrine organs which are present in the left upper quadrant of our abdominal cavity look liver pancreas these are the endocrine organs and we should not forget that spleen is also playing a very small role in the endocrine activity of the body so we should put their name also the liver right and which other the pancreas right and we also know that spleen also plays its role in the endocrine activity of the body so we should just remember that we are not writing it here right then okay then we should not forget that our suprarenal gland plays its role in the endocrine activity so we should write it there also supra renal gland which suprarenal gland the the left suprarenal gland or the left uh, adrenal gland is present there which which plays its role in the endocrine activity of the body so the, so left uh, suprarenal gland is also an endocrine part of the left upper quadrant of our abdominal cavity right friends number third group of organs are there excretory organs excretory organs yes we have excretory organs in our left upper quadrant of the abdominal cavity we have the kidney look this is your kidney present there so we say kidney which kidney left kidney kidney and then there are there is the ureter is also present there so left ureter left proximal ureter right not all parts of the ureter left proximal ureter is found in the left upper quadrant of your abdominal cavity the fifth group of organs the fourth one that are there any lymphatic organ lymphatic organ yes we have my dear friends we have lymphatic organ and that is our friend spleen present in the left upper quadrant of our abdominal cavity so spleen plays its role in the uh, lymphatic drainage of our abdomen right so lymphatic organ found in the left upper quadrant of our abdominal cavity is our spleen okay are there any reproductive organs there reproductive organs in the left upper quadrant of abdominal cavity no my dear friends there is no reproductive organ present in the left upper quadrant of the abdominal cavity right so this completes the the picture or the lecture regarding the left upper quadrant 
of the abdominal cavity and the organs which are found in the left upper quadrant of the abdominal cavity. I hope you like the lecture and I hope you have learned something from this lecture. So if you like and if you have learned then hit the like button and please share these videos with your friends also. See you in the next lecture regarding the, the, the discussion on the left lower quadrant of the abdominal cavity and then we will finish that. So be there and keep watching. Thank you so much.